Welcome back to the Virtual Pub Quiz channel. My name is Jay and I'm the host of the Specialist Quizzes and of course the Live Quiz on Thursday and Saturday evenings. Welcome along to today's Specialist Quiz and it is the return of the Friends Quiz. You guys went mad for this last week. Social media was just brilliant. A lot of you were very, very uh, pleased with some of the questions. A lot of you were very, very disappointed that with some of your scores. Hopefully you can make amends this, afternoon, or this evening or whenever you're watching this. So it's series three and four today, but we're doing series four in this, so we can't avoid the big quiz that was in series four itself in Friends. So we've got 20 questions, series three and series four. And if I just scroll my little, uh, my word doc down, we've got an additional 13 questions because we're going to go with the quiz as well. How many of you remember that epic quiz? In my personal opinion, it's probably in the top three of my favourite ever episodes of Friends. And it was the episode, uh, the one with the embryos, where Ross and uh, Ross set the quiz so that the boys played against the girls. It was absolutely, I love that episode. It's absolutely brilliant. But I've got the questions for it and I've got the answers for it as well. So if you want to stick with just the 20 questions and just do that as a bit of fun, absolutely, you know, it's entirely up to you. You guys are setting the rules, competing against each other. So I'm not going to get involved or if you want to use it as a bit of a bonus, please do. But we'll do the first 20 questions first. We've got series three and series four to get through. Let's start then with series three. Question one. Which Star Wars character did Rachel dress up as for Ross? So which Star Wars character did Rachel dress up for? Uh, dress, dress up as for Ross. Question two: When Monica ordered a new bed, what kind of bed turned up in error? So when Monica ordered a new bed, what kind of bed turned up in error? Number three, what was the name of the Dutch girl that Joey and Chandler fought over in the one with the football? So what was the name of the Dutch girl that Joey and Chandler fought over in the one with the football? It's a great episode that. Number four, which cookies did Monica become addicted to, forcing Ross to cut her off? That's the flavor we're after, not the brand, but the flavor. So which cookies did Monica become addicted to, forcing Ross to cut her off? Number five, Joey is reading which book that Rachel tells him to put into the freezer so he doesn't have to finish it. So Joey is reading which book that Rachel tells him to put into the freezer Number six, who tells Rachel that Ross had slept with Chloe? If you remember, he's trying to follow the trail. So who tells Rachel that Ross had slept with Chloe? Number seven, who left Monica a $20,000 tip? Who left Monica a $20,000 tip? Number eight, which person has to choose between dating a fireman or a kindergarten teacher? So who had to choose between dating a fireman or a kindergarten teacher? Number nine, who did Phoebe set up on a date with uh, Bonnie? So who did Phoebe set up on a date with Bonnie? And then finally, number 10, Phoebe again. So who does Phoebe meet when the gang go to the beach house at the end of series three? Or who does she find out who it is? So who does Phoebe meet with when the gang go to the beach house at the end of series three? So 
So let's move on then to series four, question one. Um, who peed on Monica when she got stung by a jellyfish? So who peed on Monica when she got stung by a jellyfish? Number two, what is the name of the woman who comes between Joey and Chandler that causes Chandler to live in a box? So what's the name of the woman who comes between Joey and Chandler that causes Chandler to live in a box? And think about what he has done. Number three, who does Joey help practice ballroom dancing? So who does Joey help practice ballroom dancing? Number four, whose dressing room does Joey sneak into so he can use the shower after a three day fishing trip? So whose dressing room does Joey sneak into so he can use the shower after a three day fishing trip? Number five, who is Phoebe carrying the babies for? So who is Phoebe carrying the babies for? Number six, who asks Ross to take Emily out? So who asks Ross to take Emily out? Number seven, where does Chandler, or which country does Chandler tell Janice he is being transferred to? Which country does Chandler tell Janice he is being transferred to? Oh, hang on. I might have said country and I might have messed that up then. One moment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. Oh, I was right. I broke my phone. Uh, number eight. Meeting him whilst working as a personal shopper. What was the name of Rachel's boyfriend who leaves him for good when seeing her in a wedding dress? So meeting him whilst working as a personal shopper, what was the name of Rachel's boyfriend who leaves him for good when seeing her in a wedding dress? Number nine, who does Joey get a video recording of on his phone when in London? So who does Joey get a video recording of on his phone when he's in London? Now, I forgot that I hadn't put a question 10 in because I've put Ross's quiz in as effectively question 10. But there's 13 of these questions. So it's up to you if you're playing against people and you want to finish the quiz there or if you really, really want to test them and test their knowledge. I'll give you these questions now and I'll give you all the answers together at the end. So. This is the quiz from that episode, the one with the embryos. It was the boys against the girls. If you remember, it was Joey and Chandler versus Monica and Rachel with Ross being the quiz master. They even released a board game around this as well, um, trying to capitalize. So 13 questions that they went through. Here is number one. What is Monica's biggest pet peeve? So what is Monica's biggest pet peeve? Number two, according to Chandler, what phenomenon scares the bejesus out of him? So according to Chandler, what phenomenon scares the bejesus out of him? Number three, every week the TV guide comes to Joey and Chandler's apartment, but what name appears on the address label? 
So every week the TV guide comes to Joey and Chandler's apartment, but what name appears on the address label? Number four. Monica and Ross had a grandmother who died. All of the friends went to the funeral. Name that grandmother. So Monica and Ross had a grandmother who died. All the friends went to the funeral. Name the grandmother. Number five, what is the name of Chandler's father's Las Vegas all male burlesque? So what is the name of Chandler's father's Las Vegas all male burlesque? Number six, what was Monica's nickname when she was a field hockey goalie? Number seven, Rachel claims this is her favorite movie. So number seven, Rachel claims this is her favorite movie. Her actual favourite movie for number eight is. So number eight, Rachel's actual favourite movie is. Mm -hmm. Number nine, in what part of the body did Monica get a pencil stuck at age 14? So in what part of her body did Monica get a pencil stuck at age 14? Number 10, Monica categorizes her towels, but how many categories are there? So Monica categorizes her towels, but how many categories are there? Number 11, what is Joey's favorite food? So what is Joey's favorite food? Number 12, Chandler was how old when he first touch a, touched a girl's breast? So number 12, Chandler was how old when he first touched a girl's breast? Number 13, Joey had an imaginary childhood friend. His name was, what was his name? So number 13, Joey had an imaginary childhood friend. His name was, I know I said 13 before, but I forgot there was a second page when I typed this up earlier. So there's two more to go. Number 14, and his profession was, so Joey's imaginary friend's profession was what? And finally, number 15. It stumped the girls, but can you remember? What is Chandler's job? So at that point in Friends, what was Chandler's job? Okay, so that is your quiz then. So you've got 19 questions on series three and series four, and then the fantastic quiz that they did in series four in the one with the embryo. So if you want to take a few minutes, however long you need, all you need to do is just pause the video now. And welcome back. Hopefully you've got all your answers prepared. You've swapped over your sheets if you're competing with people or you're sat eagerly awaiting the answers to see how you've got on. Let's go through them then. Start with series three, number one. Uh, which Star Wars character did Rachel dress up as for Ross? It was, of course, Princess Leia. Number two, when Monica ordered a new bed, what kind turned up in error? It was a race car bed. Number three, what was the name of the Dutch girl that Joey and Chandler fought over in the one with the football? It was Marga. Maha. 
as, J as Chandler pronounced it, but it was Marga. Number four, which cookies did Monica become addicted to, forcing Ross to cut her off? It was mint treasures. They'd say we wanted the flavor we didn't want, so it was mint treasures. Number five, Joey is reading which book that Rachel tells him to put into the freezer. It was Little Women. Number six, who tells Rachel that Ross had slept with Chloe? Well, he followed the trail, he eventually worked out it was Gunther. Number seven, who left Monica a $20,000 tip? It was Pete Becker. Number eight, which person has to choose between dating a fireman or a kindergarten teacher? It was Phoebe. Number nine, who did Phoebe set up on a date with Bonnie? It was Ross. And finally, number 10, who does Phoebe meet up with when the gang go to the beach house at the end of series three? It was her birth mother, Phoebe. Series four, question one, who peed on Monica when she got stung by a jellyfish? It was Chandler. Monica couldn't do it, Joey couldn't do it, Chandler stepped up. Number two, what is the name of the woman who comes between Joey and Chandler that causes Chandler to be living in a box? It was, of course, Kathy. Number three, who does Joey help practice ballroom dancing? Oh, it was Trigger. That was his name. A lot of you might have put supervisor, but yeah, his name was Trigger. Number four, whose dressing room does Joey sneak into so he can use the shower after a three day fishing trip? It was Charlton Heston. Number five, who is Phoebe carrying the babies for? Well, it was Frank and Alice. So yeah, brother Frank. Number six, who asks Ross to take Emily out? It was Rachel. Number seven, where does Chandler tell Janice he is being transferred to? It was Yemen. Yemen Road, Yemen. Number eight, meeting him whilst working as a personal shopper. What was the name of Rachel's boyfriend who leaves for good when seeing her in a wedding dress? It was Joshua. Joshua, Joshua. And number nine, who does Joey get a video recording of on his phone when in London? It was the Duchess of York, Sarah Ferguson. He comes back and winds Chandler up of who he met. So Ross's quiz then, the 15 questions that they all went head to head. How did you do? Did you remember them? Let's go through the answers. Number one, what is Monica's biggest pet peeve? Animals dressed as humans. Number two, according to Chandler, what phenomenon scares the bejesus out of him? Uh, it's Michael Flatley, Lord of the Dance. His legs flared about as if independent from his body. Number three, every week the TV guide comes to Joey and Chandler's apartment. What name appears on the address label? It's Miss Chananda Labong. Number four, Monica and Ross had a grandmother who died. All the friends went to the funeral, named the grandmother. It was Althea. Number five, what is the name of Chandler's father's Las Vegas all-male burlesque? It's Viva Los Gagas. Number six, what was Monica's nickname when she was a field hockey goalie? Big fat goalie. <coughs> Excuse me. Number seven, Rachel claims that this is her favorite movie. It's Dangerous Liaisons. Number eight, her actual favorite movie is Weekend at Bernie's. Number nine, in what part of her body did Monica get a pencil stuck at age 14? It was her ear. Number 10, Monica categorizes her towels. How many categories are there? Uh, 11. Question 11, what is Joey's favorite food? It's sandwiches. 
Number 12, Chandler was how old when he first touched a girl's breast? It was 19. Question 13, Joey had an imaginary childhood friend. His name was Maurice. And question 14, so the imaginary friend's profession was, or so Maurice's profession was, space cowboy. And finally, question 15, what is Chandler Bing's job? At that point in Friends, series four, what was his job? He was a statistical and data reconfigurator, not a transponster. A lot of you probably put transponster, but that was the answer Rachel gave, and it was wrong, unfortunately. So that is your Friends quiz for this week. A bit of an extended edition because we put that quiz in from Series 4. Um, let us know how you got on uh, in the comments below. Hashtags down that way. There you go. Hashtags there if you want to use that on social media, Twitter and Instagram. Uh, or let us know on the Facebook page how you got on with this. Uh, next week we move on to Series 5 and Series 6. Same time next Tuesday we'll be back. And if you've been holding these quizzes together, um, I saw a few comments saying we'll get them all together when they've all been recorded and we'll do them in one go. I love that. So um, you'll be watching part five, uh, part three, but series five and six in just a few moments. Uh, if not, we'll see you again soon. Don't forget, we've got another uh, specialist quiz. Uh, so the specialist quizzes are every Sunday, Tuesday and Wednesday. And obviously the big live quiz, that's what the channel is mainly here for, which is the big live quiz on Thursday night and Saturday night. Thank you for your support as always. Uh, it means the world and all your very kind messages. And if I don't see you before, we'll see you on the next one. Take care, stay safe.